Hi there, guitar fellows. This is Michael here, and I just received this box from Gent Guitars, right? Um, and this is JS 380 finish in red. I'm really dying to open this box, and I'm really dying to find out what is all the booze about those guitars because a lot of YouTubers and other guitar players that I know praise those guitars for the money you pay for them. Um, so I'm really, really curious what they're all about, right? A um, friend of mine, Barry, has a few of those guitars and he was um, praising them a lot, especially the necks and stuff like that. So uh, he, he hooked me up with Lee from Jet Guitars and just sending for emails, I bought one of these. So this is not like sponsored video or anything like that. I paid for the guitar myself. So um, this is going to be honest review of this guitar and unboxing. So I'm probably going to do it in a few videos. I'm probably going to do this one as unboxing. Then probably another day am I going to do it, uh, just play through it, I'm just going to try to set it up um, and stuff like that and see how I find it, that guitar against my fenders. And then maybe do some videos with it, you know, so um, really looking forward uh, to find out what she's all about. Okay, so here we go. Let's open this box. Actually came very, very quickly. Uh, fairly cooking. Out of the last Friday, it's Thursday today, and it's right here. So let's see what we have here. Right, we got a bit of check. Nice. Okay, let's start back. It's on the voice, great. Okay, here it is. Jet guitars. box so uh, no score here for EPS bashing it around okay. Ooh. Ooh la la Already. The pedal looks great. Alright, let's get all this stuff. And there she is. Right. It's the back of it. Okay, like what I've heard a lot about jet guitars is the necks. Alright. Without a little bit out of tune, but it's fine. It's a nice edges for what you pay for. Maybe a little bit tiny polishing, but it's it's nothing major. It's actually pretty smooth. Well, um, you wouldn't expect that from the budget guitar to be done like this. Is the locking tuners. Okay, there we go. And that's the body. You can see the music track better go. She looks steady. Beautiful. Wow. Okay, let's do another video with a few different angles. Okay, so there she is. There's the thread edges. Pretty neat. Threads looks good. I haven't actually played it yet. I'm just um have a quick look at it and look into all the details that's the knot it's cut pretty fine there's nothing wrong with it yet here's your headstock is the logo okay just look at this beauty it's really nicely made really good nice neck pocket and all this neck, neck is really nice nice finish on it really like that is the uh, quality control pass and that's your jet tuners right my first thoughts on it um, I really like the neck you know um, 
look, it doesn't feel like a, a custom shop vendor neck or something like that, but it's pretty on, you know, pretty comparable with like, you know, Mexican strats. And I had loads of these, you know. And when I started playing guitar in 1998, around 2000, I got my first Squire Strat that actually my brother financed half of it, you know what I mean, at the time. And it was made in Indonesia, it was a nice Strat, you know. And then I had a couple of Chinese ones down the line and stuff like that, but they were absolutely horrendously bad. Like, they were really bad compared to what it's actually what, like, companies like Jet these days, um, you know, produce for, for the box, you know what I mean? For the money you pay for an instrument, even as a, as a starter instrument, you know, kids can learn on this to play great, you know what I mean? It's so easy now these days. Also, a seasoned musician like myself can use this guitar playing live. Um, you know, it feels great. It's really kind of snappy and loud and plugged, you know what I mean? Uh, it's pretty flawless. Like, there's no any, like, major, you know, um, crappy stuff about it. Like, it's pretty, it's smooth, it's neat, um, compared to, like, a lot of squares that I had in my life. Um, and obviously, I tried a lot of these cheap guitars because my students bring them always to me for setup and things like that and to change the strings for them and these things. So I've played lately a lot of affinities as well and <clears throat> Fender Player um, series strats, you know, and they, they're all good, but that's actually, you know, punching really, I'd say close to Mexican strats rather than the square. Um, right, let's play a couple of chords and you can hear it. So plays great, um, straight out of the box, you know what I mean? Uh, for me, I just needed a bit more setup. Um, in terms of like the gauge of strings is quite light. I think it's the eights or nines maybe. So I play 11s or 10s, you know what I mean? Now, actually last couple of years, it's mostly 11s. Um, so yeah, definitely stick 11s on it and the rock on it. What I like about it, it's actually the edges here. You know, they're not, they're not that sharp. You know, they're pretty smooth. You can still feel them a little bit, and you expect that for the money you pay for an instrument, it's fine. But it's not like some of the Harley Bentons I played or old squares, like you will actually kind of nearly cut yourself. It's actually pretty smooth. Um, and even the, the fret polish here on it, it's pretty, pretty nice. It's really nicely done, even the edges here, do you mean? So, bit of a setup maybe, bit of a tweaking, you know, and it's, she's good to go. So I'm actually looking, for, I'm dying to uh, plug it in here. Uh, turn an amp and see how the pickups are sounding so uh, please stay tuned um, don't forget to subscribe and look out for another video with this one right uh, I'm probably going to do kind of quick samples um, you know um, going through the pickups and this kind of stuff and through different sounds and then am I going to do some cover on it or some, some, some tune on it so um, yeah thank you for watching and thank you uh, to Jet Guitars for sending this beauty. Um, very pleased, very, very pleased. The tuners actually, before I go, the tuners are pretty amazing as well for the quality you get. Like, where are you gonna get that from? Guitar for like, what? 270 euros, what they advertised, recommended prices for them? I don't know, I don't think so, you know? Um, so yeah, I think, uh, I think they're the winner.